Bigbreeds and Crypto. I'm your host, Mr. Bigbreeds, coming to you live from reservation somewhere, taking a look at ABT, REQ, Suku, and SNT to complete the night. Well, let's get it started. Taking a look at AVT, AVT is coming in at 216, amazing price action, been loving that accumulation just underneath that support at 218, so uh, definitely excited to see if we can get some lower price action, I've been definitely out here lurking, uh, am I going to get the price action, could be possible, wishful thinking at this point, but I'm out here lurking, so uh, definitely loving the price action, so at 216, definitely excited to see where we're going, as far as making some moves to the upside, we definitely going to make our way up over the 786 at 257, and uh, as far as getting some bullish moves to the upside, we got to get back over the 618 at 280. Seven, make your way up to this 308 and as far as get some extremely bullish action moves to the upside we had to get back over this 398 grab some good strong support and consolidation start making our moves to the upside so that would be the awesome amazing bullish scenario with PTC being so undecided could possibly just see some sideways action until the market starts making some moves to the upside so uh, we still got a lot of stuff going on in the news today we still got this Ukraine Russia theme we got a little bit of COVID breakout going here and there we got tornadoes we got uh, snow <laughs> we got a lot of stuff going on in the news today so uh, you know I've definitely out here loving the accumulation uh getting some some good price action so uh you know keep an eye on that keep an eye on the news keep an eye on the market keep an eye on btc uh, we'll do some follow-up videos tomorrow and see where we're at so everybody able to good luck moving on up to req req coming in at 0.2205000 and then on such a you know could possibly be seeing some sideways action with btc being so undecided uh you know definitely good to see btc up over 42,000. let's take a look and see where we're at right now coming in at oh we're under 40 Two thousand in drop in. Oh man, there we go. Well, that could be possibly some uh, <laughs> some uh, sales price action. Uh, RBQ coming in at point two two oh five. So uh, definitely excited to see where we're going as far as the market. Uh, you know, could possibly see some sideways action with BTC being so undecided. So this scenario right now could possibly be the scenario we're setting up. If we do get some uh, extremely dippy action, we got to keep an eye on this point one nine nine zero. If we do come back down and retest that support, and we do lose that support, definitely. Gonna see lower price action so uh keep an eye on that price action as far as making smooth to the upside we definitely get back over that 0.4134 grabs consolidation make your way up to this 0.5817 and uh start making our way up towards that uh breakout action at a dollar 20 so that would be extremely bullish uh, uh moves to the upside uh, with btc being so undecided could possibly see some sideways action or if we and we do get some dippy action we definitely got to keep an eye on that support at 0 0.1990 so keep an eye on that price action we'll do some follow-up videos videos tomorrow and see where we're at so everybody REQ good luck uh moving on up to suku suku's actually made some awesome move up movement up to the upside i was coming into some uh, good price action there at around uh point 20 uh definitely getting some love and making some moves to the upside you know definitely awesome to see suku coming in at 0 0.2608 awesome uh you know could mean <clears throat> so as far as suku making some moves to the upside we definitely gotta get back over that 0.3227 grab some support consolidation make our way up to this point 4020 for some awesome amazing recovery to the upside uh you know that would be the ideal situation for suku that would be the super bullish scenario uh definitely excited to see where we're going as far as uh suku and as far as getting extremely bullish moves to the upside, we got to get back over that 618 at 0.4643, make our way up to this 0.5518. And then as far as getting some breakout action and moves to the upside, we got to get back over that 0.6935, start making that next leg up. So definitely excited to see where we're going as far as Suku. Uh, you know, could possibly see the sideways action setting up with BTC being so undecided. Uh, just taking a look at BTC moments go, coming under 42,000. So that could possibly, you know, put a damper on, the, on that breakout scenario. I hate to see that but uh you know just when suku's starting to make some moves up to the upside btc puts that gravity on but if suku's got that fu money going on and we just start making some moves to the upside uh that would definitely be awesome too so i'm definitely excited to see where we're going as far as that that price action on suku so everybody suku good luck we'll do a follow-up video tomorrow and see where we're at moving on up to snt snt coming up 0.0596 seeing it coming in at 0.6 i thought i was making some moves to the upside but that btc gravity starting to kick in and starting to make the 
a few of the projects pulled back uh, just when they were making some moves back up to the upside. But, you know, definitely excited to see where we're going. You know, BTC could possibly get some traction, start making some moves back up to the upside. Just could be just decent correction. <laughs> but uh, we definitely got to keep an eye on that price action. We still got a lot of stuff going on in the news today. Like we were saying earlier, we got uh, Ukraine and Russia go stuff going on. We got COVID stuff going on. We got tornadoes. We got uh, a lot of stuff going on that is going to affect the market. So we definitely got to keep an eye on, on the news, uh, keep an eye on BTC and keep an eye on that price action. So we got S&T coming in at 0 0.0596. Uh, definitely amazing price action. Uh, you know, loving that accumulation. Uh, definitely trying to make some moves to the upside. Make it, made it back above that support at 0 0.0586. Coming in at 0 0.0596. So, uh, you know, with BTC being so undecided, could possibly just see some sideways action with BTC being so undecided. But uh, if we do got that few money on s and and we start making some moves to the upside, we definitely get back over this uh, 786 at 0.0620. Grab some support and consolidation. Possibly see some sideways action above the 786 with BTC being so undecided. Uh, but as far as getting some extremely bullish action to move to the upside, we to get back over this 0 0.0646. Grab some support and consolidation. Make our way up to this 0 0.0707. And as far as getting some extremely bullish action to move to the upside, we got to get back over this 0 0.0744. Grab some support and consolidation. Start making some moves to the upside. So keep an eye on that price action and uh, keep an eye on BTC. If we do start getting some dippy action, we got to keep an eye on that support at 0.0586. If we do lose that support, I uh, definitely could possibly see some lower price action. I was out here looking for that 0.0488. So, you know, am I going to get that price action? You know, that just remains to be seen. So keep an eye on that price action. Keep an eye on the news. We'll do some follow-up videos tomorrow and see where we're at. So everybody, all the coins we talked about tonight, good luck. And you always have to remember this is not financial advice. These are my views and opinions on the market only. And you always have to do what's right for you. So you always have a good afternoon, good evening, good morning, good night. Mr. Big Braids is signing out.